Hi, everybody. Welcome to Story Time. It's our weekly show. Welcome everyone that is joining us. As you can see, today is pre recorded, but that's okay. I will be down there chatting with you and hearing what you have to say and just came to read you your weekly story. I hope everyone has done well this week, has social distance, washed their hands, wore their masks, done all that stuff that they need to do to stay safe. And as always, I miss you all so much. I can't wait for the day for us to meet together again in person. But until then, we're just going to stick with it right here online. Yeah. Definitely tell me what you've been up to. Feel free to comment. Even though this is pre-recorded, I will be there to read and comment back. Absolutely. We're going to start a story today. We're going to read a little bit of a Dr. Seuss book again. Right? We're going to read Wacky Wednesday by Dr. Seuss. Have you ever had a Wacky Wednesday? I've had a Wacky Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday. I have wad wacky days all here and there. Absolutely. So let's get this story started. Yeah. It began with a shoe on the wall. A shoe on the wall? It shouldn't be there at all. I don't know. If I woke up with a shoe on my wall, I might be a little concerned. It's definitely a wacky day already. Then I looked up. And I said, oh, man, ha, this must be Wacky Wednesday again. Not only is there a shoe on the wall, but there's a shoe on the roof. What craziness is this? Tell you. I looked out the window and I said, gee, more things were wacky. And then I saw three. So can you see some of the wackiness here? I can. I don't know if bananas grow on apple trees or not. And then the sprinkler's got a break in it here, and it's still sprinkling. Oh, my goodness. And then I went down the hall, and I said, hey, three things. More things were wacky today. So let's see. Can you pick out what's, what's wacky going on here? I see that they have the broom going on. Yep, the broom's standing by itself. And then what's this? Candy cane leg. Oh my goodness. So much going on there. I tell you. It's a lot. Oh my. And I didn't even see that. Two doorknobs. And in the bathroom, more. And in the bathroom, there were four. Yep. I don't know. A, a palm tree growing out of a toilet. <laughs> oh my goodness. That's crazy. And then there was an upside down faucet. I tell you, so much going on that wacky day. I began to dress and then I said, wow, four more things were wacky now. There are more shoes on the wall and ceiling. And then the dresser is open. And look at that. The chair's broken leg there. That's, that's really wacky. I tell you, I remember those wacky days. I don't think anything happened like that to me that wacky. That's pretty wacky. I looked in the kitchen and I said, bye, Cracky. Five more things are there wacky. First of all, the mouse is chasing the cat. And then we have the umbrella up in the, the pot there cooking. And it looks like a little bug is holding up the refrigerator. Oh, my goodness. There's so much wackiness going on there. I tell you. And I was late for school. I started along. And then I saw six more things that were wrong. Let's see. What else can we picture that's wrong? I see the tree coming out of the chimney. I see the backseat driver. Right here. I don't know if that's wrong, but they had their kitty cat or a tiger there in the baby carriage. So much stuff going on there, I tell you. And then there was seven more. Oh, my goodness. Look at this. They have a shoe on the hat. They lost their back tires, and the man is running. That's not the car I want to be in. And then it looks like over here, or is it over here, is the shoe. Oh, my goodness. So much wacky stuff going on. Definitely a wacky, wacky Wednesday. 
And the Sutherland sisters, they looked wacky too. They said, nothing is wacky around here but you. They're missing a legs. One of them are missing legs. That is so wacky. Oh my goodness, I tell you. But I looked and I yelled, eight things are wrong here at school. Nothing is wrong, they said. Don't be a fool. Well, first of all, the school is for sale and it's spelled wrong. For sale, right? So much going on. The flag is reversed. There's animals in the school and there's a shoe on top of the flagpole. Wow. That is pretty wacky. I ran into school and I yelled to Miss Bass, look, nine things are wacky here in your class. First and foremost, right here, no head. And then this student's backwards. And that's not George Washington. Is that George Washington? I don't know. Doesn't seem right to me. It's all this wackiness, I tell you. Nothing is wacky here in my class. Get out. You're the wacky one. Out, said Miss Bass. There with her, George Washington, not the person in the picture. It's definitely not George Washington, y'all. Nope. Got kicked out of class for a wacky Wednesday. I went out the school door. Things were worse than before. I couldn't believe it. Ten wacky things more. There is so much wackiness going on in this town. First of all, they must be in Florida because look, there's a gator on a leash, an alligator. And then George Washington is backwards on the, on the statue. And it looks like a shoe on the crown of the car and a giraffe poking out of the sewer. And even crazier, look, on top of the car, there's a lady pushing a baby on top of the car. Wow, that's wacky. Then I counted 11. Oh my goodness. There is so much in this picture wrong. For sale is spelled wrong. The lady is pushing an alligator and then the lady is pushing a tree and a baby carriage. And there's just so much going on. And is that like, there's so much going on in this picture. There's even a shoe on top of the smokestack. I tell you, this is definitely a wacky day for, for them. Then 12 worse things. I got scared and I ran. I ran and knocked over Patrolman McGann. There's so much going on here, y'all. The airplane is flying backwards. The door in the middle of the road. That lady has a lot of babies. The cow has two butts. Two butts. The bridge, they're jumping. The bridge is gone. They're just jumping over it. Yep. And the Rue... He ran into Patrolman McGann. I'm sorry, Patrolman. That's all I could say. Don't be smile. Uh, sorry, he said. It's that kind of day. Be glad. Wacky Wednesday will go away soon. So see, even the Patrolman knew something was wacky on this day. And it had to go away. Yep, it did. Only 20 things were wacky he said just find them and go to bed that's a lot let's look at this two sons houses stacked on top of each other an airplane in the middle of the road the bridge or the road goes into the sky somebody has flat a uh, unicycle tree there a flying car a fish manning He's not fishing. He's manning. No legs. Oh, my goodness. We can go all day long with all this stuff. Look. Looks like somebody up in here. That's not a car. They're going the wrong way. Pushing a baby carriage in the road the wrong way. There's so much wrong with this picture. I tell you. Oh, my goodness. You see, Wacky Wednesday was gone when I counted them all. And I even got rid of the shoe on my wall boy i tell you that's a lot of wackiness going on isn't it have you had days that wacky stuff go on i have i've had days where it seemed like as soon as i opened my eyes there were just silly wacky crazy stuff going on all day long and then i was ready to go to bed 
Yeah. Yep. Have you had those wacky days? I'm sure you have. Have you had a wacky day with a shoe on your wall? I've not had that. That would probably scare me. Did it scare you? I think it would scare you too. Yeah. And then if I saw um, a lady pushing an alligator in a baby carriage, that might creep me out a little bit. I don't know. It's Florida. We've seen some weird things here, haven't we? We have. Yeah. Well, as always, I love you all so much. I'm so grateful that you all have came today to listen to my story and you've chatted with me and I've been there chatting back with you. And what's great is this is all pre-recorded and it'll be up on YouTube and Facebook and you'll be able to rewatch it over and over again. Don't forget, we have story time every Sunday at two o'clock Eastern time. Excuse me. And we have our mental health break. And we do all kinds of events throughout the week. So please, please, please go to Rose Dynasty's uh, Facebook, like it, follow it. Go to our Instagram, like and follow um, our website, check it out. And if you've had an experience with us and you love the experience that you've had with Rose Dynasty or myself, please go and leave a review for us on Facebook. We really would appreciate it. And make sure you all stay safe. You wash your hands, social distance. And we'll see you all real soon. I love you. You are loved, accepted, and wanted. And I will talk to you later. Bye.